Hello people, Max O'Carrick call a coming right here uh, on this recording. Uh, again, I'm doing a member spotlight uh, on the ultimate business reinvention. And uh, what I'm talking about is uh, how Ben Sushek has attracted more wealth to create freedom in an envious lifestyle by um, uh, Cindy Sear. So I, I started that um, reading because I wanted to make sure that you guys are aware of the things that I'm studying. Uh, I'm out there developing myself to be a massive top transformer agent, uh, really taking people from zero to hero in no time. And uh, that's how I uh, view myself. So I've constantly been in training all this year. And uh, one of the things I really got is that uh, I'm taking on coaching myself. So this is the video to really keep me accountable for the things that I say I want to do. All right. So let's get uh, right to it. Uh, using info, info first, marketing to attract his target audience. Unlike his home buying competitors who just make an offer, Ben educate his target audience with info first marketing, including an infomercial in a book he wrote about downsizing and selling a house. Education include what they will experience when they try to sell their home. We make a lot of information available and I think that's one thing that sets my company apart, Ben said. Over the years, I created information to educate a seller on what the reality of selling a house is so that when they were ready to downside, to do something, I would be hopefully the logical choice. Then educate them on what happens in a traditional sale, things such as having potentially update or repair a house on the market before the agent will even list it. Having strangers walk through their house uh, how to tell if someone is serious buyer or if they are have less than good intention. The ins and outs of house inspection and how they can affect price negotiation and so on. So these are all the things that um, uh, basically Ben Sushek did as an info first marketing. Uh, just so you know, um, a few months ago uh, in September, I just came from... Uh, my peak uh, performing reading with no BS uh, inner circle. Last month, I was at the Info Summit uh, and uh, also the day with Dan. So I realized that everything about that whole digital world, uh, when you think that everything is digital, even major companies uh, like Google, uh, Amazon, they all have a ground game as well because it's not everybody that turned... <laughs> to uh, just doing uh, digital. So anybody that's telling you otherwise, is, it's crazy. Now, uh, what I'm having to deal with is, um, uh, I realize that I wanna create massive finances uh, to really um, support my education. And I'm looking at, even if I have to create a day so that everything about that day is really to support my education. Um, I want to create the possibility of not having to get sponsors anymore. Um, because when I get sponsors, whatever I learn, I got to do it for them. So I want to create my own little group. And uh, I believe that that's uh, I know what to do. So um, part of these things that I'm doing is going to be public. Some of them are going to be uh, private. And for people to have access to the private ones, uh, I'm creating to have uh, something special about that. Okay. All right. Smart marketing and knowing what is what his audience look like and wants. Ben doesn't target the people desperate to sell. Instead, his target is boomers and seniors, individuals who are at a stage in their life where their kids have moved out and they are electing to downsize. Most have no or very little debt on their house, Ben said. They, they chose to do business with me. I think because they've looked at the information, maybe they received the book, they've watched the infomercial, and they've learned about me without me even speaking to them. Ben says typically his clients like that they 
like that, as clients like that, they don't have to worry about any the things, any of the things that come up, that come with a traditional house sale. For example, they like that. They like that. They don't have to do any updates on the house. They can move the things they want to take with them when they move, but leave everything else. They don't have to worry about all the stuff that's left behind. Downsizing solution um, uh, takes care of uh, it for them. They don't have strangers going through their house. Uh, the only people that come through their house are people associated with Ben Company. They don't have to deal with a real estate agent calling them at the last minute wanting to show their property. Their house been has transformed a bothersome chore into something else, and he is rewarded for that. I've had numerous sellers tell them, tell me when I suppose I might have been able to get more for the house if I would have had sold it in a traditional manner. But the benefits that provide are that you provide a traditional manner, but the benefits that you provide are worth it to me. I just want to sell my house and be done with it, Ben said. These are what the people are saying. Creating a business with no boundaries. I kind of like that. So let me basically see. Wow, they wrote two pages on the guy. So among Dan Kennedy Wealth Magnets, is to expand your business to a national, international scope. Traditionally, real estate agent work with boundaries. Listing and uh, selling homes within a local market. Initially, Ben expanded his market beyond Lincoln, Nebraska. Buying and selling homes in Omaha, Nebraska, Kansas City, Missouri, and uh, in Florida. Now he's taking his model and expanding it further with guidance from the No BS Inner Circle Mastermind Group. He became licensed with EXP Realty, a licensed cloud-based brokerage with no physical offices anywhere. Ben can recruit an other agent, can recruit other agent to build a national real estate team. He can even recruit agent in Canada. To attract agent, he has created a one-of-a-kind offer for agent that becomes part of his team. Ooh, I kind of like that. So let's see what they got going on. So basically, I can join, if I were into real estate, I can join, I can be licensed with the EXP Realty, a national cloud brokerage, okay, so that I can build my team anyway. I think that's a cool idea because then you don't have to be licensed everywhere because you already have access everywhere. I think that's a nice, cool thing. All right, let's see where this leads because I want to go back to my little bed. Okay, so we have one page left. Let's go and knock it out. Uh, I got less than seven minutes to do it. Member Spotlight continued page 12 from page 12. His offer the rights to use and take advantage the rights to use and take advantage of his home downsizing solution branding website book magnetic collateral uh, and system he has created and tested over the years uh, free of charge Ben also assists them In offering their clients the other solution he provides with agents join EXP Realty with him as their sponsor. He creates a win-win situation. Ben expand his reach nationally and grows his wealth and uh, income. The agents uh, in his, on his team receive support and have a way of differentiating themselves from the competitor with a proven system while they earn money and build their own passive income. Developing true independence. Ben has positioned himself 
for independence through a combination of things. Low overhead, he has figured out how to build and grow his income without a lot of employees and overhead. He runs his business from home office with a virtual assistant that handles back office work, such as important leads and uses license agent in other markets to assist with inspecting houses and liquidating the houses he wants to sell. Uh, rather than managing multiple rental properties himself, he has a manager who oversees all his rental properties. Duplication. So we know developing true independence require low overhead. Now duplication. By systematizing process and watching and tracking his marketing closely, Ben is working towards replacing himself in all day work day activity in 2019. I have much more business now, uh, and now in that I have other people that are doing most of the tasks, Ben said. Passive income. Being able to buy, being able to buy and hold rental for the last several years has put in, put us in a much better financial position. Ben said, my family can travel more and we much better off now than we were years ago. Ben believes rental properties are good. Yeah, they are good. <laughs> Passive income. So I got less than four minutes left. Way for anyone to build long-term wealth, even a non-real estate people, even for non-real estate people. It is one way to have more control over your financial future, Ben explained, unlike the stocks, the stock market where you don't know what's going to happen and have no control over with, um, no control over with rental property, the value of a rental house can just be cut into half. So you can... If you really need to liquidate things, uh, as long as you're not paying attention, as long as you're paying attention to what's going on. This worked in Ben's favor in 2008, 2009 because of a real estate value fell. His property income didn't go near as uh, much value of the property and he continued to collect his passive income. Investing in himself, uh, Rather than getting buried uh, in his business, Ben has invested in himself in education. Through the years, Ben attended even uh, attended events with the Ron Legrand. More recent and more recently, he became attending and full summit each year at the No BS Inner Circle member. He has implemented. Uh, things which all have ended up to success when i see something and hear one of the recorded calls and get an idea from that i make a note and try to implement that right away ben said he is also he has also invested in coaching most recently signing with the no bs inner circle sales engineering intensive and mastermind with nick Luisi and uh, Dr. Mike Lawrence, Ben says, one of the things learned and I am applying to my business is to, to is to look really closely at every step of the ma marketing cycle. Very specific things such as all the things we do to deploy the marketing, all the media types, the campaign call to action, and what happens when a home seller respond to an ad set. The whole flow once a seller enters the top of the funnel until when they drop out the bottom, the exact step, the exact step, they drop to the bottom, the exact step along the way and even after the, we purchase the property. Uh, so really looking at that entire sales process to see how it can be improved. 
positioning for opportunities. Both creatively and financially, he put himself in a position to seize opportunity at a time where others could only see stress. For example, during the real estate crash, while others were desperate to unload houses that have been all right <laughs> so really looking at that entire that entire sales process to see how it can be improved okay positioning for opportunities both creatively and financially he put himself in a position to seize opportunity at a time where others could only see stress for example during the real estate crash while others were desperate to unload houses that had been selling in inflated prices he was able to buy and sell house at a competitive price that also a uh, time when I was one of the few buyers that was actually buying houses Ben said because I could buy with different terms and because I could buy and my income wasn't showing uh, the effects by and by seeing able by seeing able to then hold those horse houses and keep them uh, as rental they paid for themselves over time by applying these principles over the 10 year 10 years Ben has not only created more freedom he he doubled the amount of business he um, has done each year and um, follow the lead and you will and you can attract more wealth and prosperity in your life all right thank you very much uh, for all those who were actually watching um i'm committed to actually get you those uh, marketing wealth strategies okay all right stay blessed bye bye guys